What's up, everybody? It's John and John Sports Guys coming out to the brand new video here on this Friday. How's everyone doing today? End of the week, TGIF. It's time to open up a mystery product. This is the Mega Mystery Power Box. This is an includes over $50 of retail value. Let's see if that's true. Um, we're looking for something not this, but something similar to this. It's red. And uh, there might be some older packs in there that, that could be pretty good. Power Cube, I don't think that's in here because those are normally pretty heavy and this doesn't feel that way. Boys of Summer, possibly. Spring Fever Baseball Box. This thing back here uh, includes one value pack, one fat pack, or hanger pack, one factory seal, fact, seal pack, one chase item, and three bonus items. Here's the side of the box. I bought this stuff at eBay. This is really, really, really difficult to find. I don't think this is actually ever in the stores here in, in our area, in the Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania area. This would be a Walmart exclusive type product, and I didn't ever saw it. I want to think that maybe this is only available at Myers, which is uh, the closest one is in Ohio. So let's get this open and see if we can get it out of here. It's not tampered with. You got to worry about things like that on eBay. Let's see if I did it enough. You have to worry about things like that on eBay with products like this. Now, I'm sure they could probably see, somehow see through the bottom here. May get an idea what was in here. Um, I think this product is either, I think it's like $30 normal. I paid a little, obviously more than that for this. Again, something, sometimes I'm willing to pay more than, you know, the value of something, you know, on a retail side when I know I can't find it anywhere. And I, buy, I bought, you know, I bit the bull with this one. As far as the original sale goes, let's see what's in here. Turn this around. This, is, this box is big, big, big. I don't want to knock the camera over. Come on. Let's just pull out what's in here. I'll keep it st standing up. Oh, yes. And this is what we were looking for, folks. Right there. How about that? Here's the rest of the stuff. Let's get it out here. Here's a big... Uh, let's just pull everything out. Very cool. Oh, we're going to save something for another video because there's a lot in here. All right, I'm loving this. Here we go. Let's see what we have here. Um, okay. All right, let's put the mega, mega box back in the back. Okay, we've got Tops Big Sticks. Five movable Boston Red Sox stickers. I'm going not going to open this. I'm going to save that. Maybe we'll give it as a giveaway. Okay. So there's that. This we're going to save for a future video because I love opening up these, these blister packs. Um, and this will be a good for a standalone video on its own. There's a pack of Donruss, it looks like, in here. And a Frank Thomas timeline. And a Mike Messina. Uh, back here, you got a Captain Crunch or a horse sizer and a Fred McGriff. Um, yeah, this is, this is an old Fairfield one. That's pretty neat. So we're going to save that, too. This stuff, we're not going to open this up. We'll give that to the kids. Triple play. But these things we will open up. Cool. All right, let's see. This we're definitely doing last. Now, the reason I was hoping this was going to be in there in this box was because that product could have 2011, I think it's 11... Um, update packs. I saw one video I talked about before, and I think the guy was legitimate with it. Um, and he found a pack of those in, in there. And that's what, what made me want to kind of purchase this the first time. All right, so we got here three packs. Um, Upper Deck, great value, it says here. This is made by a company called Vintage out of Conroe, Texas. Always old glue. around i just wondering they got all this stuff it was this all sitting in mj holdings uh warehouse they decided let's put together oh that's torn because so i think i just tore it the wrapper no big deal i think it's 2006 pack all right it is our 2007 
And there we go with these. Okay, so we're looking at here. Dozen seven tops. Fleer Ultra from 2007. And then an upper deck pack from 2007, Series 1, with the captain on the front. Let's open up the Fleer first. This glue is like really preventing. Let's just go to this end. All right. Okay, here we go. Gary Sheffield, and these are a little stuck. We don't have too much paper loss. Gary Sheffield. What's the back of these look like? Connor Jackson. Uh, Michael Cudier. Rookie of Cesar Jimenez. Card, ultra rookie, and then lucky 13, um, Igawa, rookie card. It's pretty cool. The ding down the corner, it's not good. All right, let's go on to the next one. Upper deck will do. Okay. Glenn Perkins, rookie card. Miguel Tejada. Here's the back. Meredith. Chris Young. Andre Ethier. Mike Gonzalez. Eric Chavez. Aubrey Huff with the Throwback Astros Union. Okay. 2007. It's already torn a little bit. Scott Thorman. Alejandro Deaza, rookie card for the Marlins. Russell Martin, cup card. It's not bad. Take that. David. DeLucci, Gustavo, Chasen, Gary Sheffield. So we started with Gary Sheffield and with Gary Sheffield out of that product. Okay, Boys of Summer, five factory seal packs inside. For some reason, they've got a uh, Beckett thing for the uh, <laughs> MMA type, you know, uh, UFC fighting things. And when we're there in Judge, look for dual promos, ultra rare rares, and uncommons. And here are the packs. Uh, Honus bonus. Hopefully that's not in here. I think you can do if it is, obviously, but let's just see. Okay. There we go, finally. Okay. Let's see. Box. Let's see where packs are. Honus bonus. Honus bonus. Let's save those. All right, let's open them up. First of all, we have a um, a mantle. Very cool. Oh, Aaron Judge. Let's see what that is. Where's this box? Aaron Judge is a rare. Ooh. Oh no, uncommon. Judge and mantle. So I'll check the value of this. These actually can be. Worth a few bucks, so that's nice. Let's put that over here. All right, bonus bonus. We've also got nice 2016 series one, 2016 series two, and another 2007. Okay, let's see the bonus bonus. I want you guys to see what this looks like. These look like now. This company went belly up. They this is like a game, and they had all kinds of crazy prizes that you could win. And this is this was around before I got back in the in the in the uh, hobby a few years ago. Um, but I think there was, they went out the same year I came in, perhaps, which is if I can see the, the date on the back of these. Anyway, here's what they look like. They're actually not bad looking cards. They didn't have the rights to anything. Um, which you can see here, the Brandon Nemo, and they put the, um, Yank, well, New York Queens for the Yank, I guess, in, 
Okay. Um, so there you go with that. So Matt Kemp, Gibbons, Wainwright, Galsman. He sold zero value. But you can see like a game piece. I think he scratched that off. I don't even know how the game works. But they went bankrupt. Pilar, Castro, Martinez. So the second one, just for fun. I don't know if Mike Trout's in this or not. Now that might be worth like five bucks. Who knows? You can still buy boxes of this too. Um, is that Russell Martin? No, Leone's Martin. Howie Kendrick, Scherzer, Anderson, Strickland, Hernandez. It's got a foil, so that's something different. Cesar Hernandez. Ian Kinsler and Carlos Santana. Okay, so there you go. That's a bonus bonus. So those are throw-ins. Not as bad as triple play. The caricature cards. Which are kind of cool. I mean, actually, the, the Trout card, I keep talking about every time we come across the Trout card. Um, and one of the years is actually worth a few dollars. Okay, here we go. This is um, 2007 Tops Baseball. Nice. How about that? Now, this is not... Wait, is this... Did I just pull... No, that can't be right. <laughs> that can't be right. Anyway, here's Alex Gordon's rookie card. Is this the infamous rookie card? I could not have pulled this. This is the one that was supposed to not be in in the in it. I don't know. I got to put that one aside and make sure. Because if it is, that, that's incredible. Dan Johnson. I thought it was in 2006s, but maybe it is 2007. I don't know. But anyway, it's his rookie card. It's, I, th I think I'm think i thinking of the right player, right? Um, okay, Dan Johnson. I'm just trying to th I was kind of thrown a, thrown a, a loop by that there. Nice hit parade. Alex Rodriguez. All-star game. Alex Cora. Matt Diaz. Francisco Rodriguez. Okay, top series one, 2016. Okay, Colby Lewis, Logan Forsyth, Michael Brantley, Hollywood Production, Escobar World Series card, uh, Sidney Koufax, it's like a Burger's Best, Gerald Salte Machia, Martin Maldonado, here's the back, these look like, by the way, on this part many, many times here on the channel, has Monty Grundell, Future Stars, Jake Peavy, Chase Utley, John Jaso. Now, if this Alex Gordon is the one I'm thinking of, which is incredible, I will put a thing at the end of this video, so I can add on. Oops. Okay. Okay, here's 2016 Series 2. Meister Mike Trout on the front of the pack. Adam Duvall, Franklin Gutierrez, Trevor Brown rookie card. Uh, Ruby De La Rosa, Johnny Cueto, Keon Broxton. Broxton, I'm sorry. Rookie card. Brad Miller, Mike Folk Folknowavitz, numbered, 216 out of 589. Chasing um, 3K, Ichiro, nice insert. David Ortiz, uh, 500 career home runs. Insert, bunt add insert. Lonnie Chisenhall, the man who never played one single game for our Pirates. Who, for some reason, is our roster. We never even got an answer, and then he's gone. Anthony Ghosts. Okay, let's do this one. Here we go. There's four packs in here. 
Fingers crossed, folks. Fingers crossed. Let's see if we can get out of this. Let me see if I can get this open. This is always a pain in the butt. Try to get this open because they glue this down so bad. And pull one of the sides. This is an easier way to get this open. Let's see. Inspecting the box. I don't want to cut it. Well, let's try. Let's see if that works. I think it did. All right, let's see what the packs are. Fingers crossed, folks. Fingers crossed. Okay, empty box. We have 2012 Tops Baseball Series 1. We have 2012 Series 2. We have 2012 Update. And we have 2012 Gypsy Queen. Now this is going to have Harper uh, possibly in it. So we're looking for 2011, but we still got something really, really good. Let's do this Gypsy Queen first. And we'll do that one last, okay? We'll go in order like this. All right. I think that's what we're going to get. I'm so nervous, everybody. I'm so nervous. Okay, Gypsy Queen. Nick Markakis. Here's the back. Scutaro. John Axford. The sliding Stars, a mini. Sliding Stars, Pedroia. Mini here of, who is this? Ted Lilly. And we end with the Glove Stories, Chris Young. It's an okay pack. All right, let's do the next one, which is 2012 Topps Baseball Series 1. It's Roy Halliday in the front of the pack. Rest in peace. Okay. Okay, here we go. Neil Walker. Jose Tabata. What's the back of these look like? Matt Latos. Golden Grace, Jackie Robinson. Gold Standard, Joe DiMaggio. Tim Federowitz. Rookie card, Mitch Moreland. And then you've got uh, Reyes, Braun, and Kemp. Uh, batting average leaders. Okay. Series two of this year. JJ Hardy, Dan Heron, Gabby Sanchez, Andre Ethier. Uh, Tatiyama, rookie card for the Rangers. George Brett, golden moments. Too bad they don't do this anymore. Congratulations on unlock your points. Wish we could still do that. I actually went and looked. It's way gone. Uh, Coco Crisp. Trayvon Robinson. Rod Barajas. <laughs> I forgot about him. Uh, Dylan G. And then Kyle Drabeck. Okay. Let's do this last pack. This is... Uh, 2012 update. I'm sure this is probably goes from decent money online. I don't know, but let's open it up and find out what we can pull out of here. Look for our exclusive red border parallel cards. Okay, here we go, folks. Let me make sure I'm not gonna. Let me see if I just pull this. I'm afraid to like cut it, but I don't want to ruin the corners either. Okay, by pulling it, but we're going to just the card. Something felt funny in there. Like I didn't want to cut it by mistake. Okay, let's see here we get out of here. Franklin Morales starts us all out. Matt Diaz. Jerome Williams. Josh Edgin. Red uh, Brian Dozier. I think this, it, I don't know if it's this year. I know the Reds or the Trouts are like worth a ton, but I don't know if it's this year. It's a nice rookie card there, Brian Dozier. So that's cool. Put that one aside. You've got here Blockbusters. 
Yankees get Sabathia. Baseball Times. What's this? Ever wonder who scored the final run against the Reds in the NLCS? 1979. That's a game. That's like a game insert. Jeffrey Alf Alfled. To, mm, I'm gonna say his name. Clay Rapida. Brad Lincoln. He was supposed to be like a superstar for us too. I think this is him. Yeah, we traded him to the Blue Jays. And he just went nowhere. Brad Lincoln for the uh for the Blue Jays there. Craig Stammen and then Hugh Darvish, rookie debut card. All right. Look how young he looks there. All right, this wasn't bad at all. Um Okay, now, I think, let me just showcase what we found here. First of all, we've got this nice um, Aaron Judge mantle. This is ultra rare, I think it is. That's pretty cool. Check that out. You just saw us pull this Hugh Darvish, this Dozier, 2012 update. Very nice gold standard here of DiMaggio. Uh, Mike here, serial number card. I love this hit parade. Rodriguez insert. Cam Brooks and rookie card. Russell Martin cup card. I'm going to go check on this Alex Gordon. And um, I'll be right back. Hold on a second. That's right here. Hold on one second, folks. We'll be right back. I'm not going to add an add on. And we'll, then we'll close it out. Okay. So this is, I was correct. 2006 is the one that, that's uh, the extremely valuable one that uh, is hard to find. This is 2007. I wasn't aware that he actually had one in the 2007 release. So this would be like his second rookie card from Topps. So, um, basically, the story behind the 2006 card is... It was it was put in uh, certain packs, and I can't remember which one's at the top of my head. And it wasn't supposed to be in there. And I think they I don't know if they stopped the production of it and corrected that error or how it happened. But um, I don't think that card was supposed to be in there. Um, anyway, this is this is the second go around with his rookie card. So, but still cool. You know, it's worth anywhere between a buck to ten bucks. It's on eBay. I was trying to see if there are any gray ones. I didn't see very many. Still cool to get that. I just wanted to make sure that I wasn't like overlooking something that was massive or I wasn't getting too excited about something without having all my information together. So there you go with that. I just want to add add that on here at the end here. So um yeah, I'm glad you were able to join us today. This is this product is awesome. I love it. We have a couple things over here. One thing we're gonna open up on another video, and one we'll give the kids, and one we'll probably do as a giveaway. But there you go, guys. That's it for today. This has been lots and lots of fun. Um, very cool stuff. I love the fact that this was in here and we had the chance of finding it's 2011 uh, packs update. Uh, and we got a 2012 update, which is just as good. Not as good, but you know what I mean? It's pretty good to get that out of this kind of product because you can't find those packs anywhere um, except if you want to pay a ton of money on eBay. That's all I got for you guys today. Hey, remember, if you're not subscribed, like to see here, hit the subscribe button right below my name. Make sure you see a thumbs up, comment down below, which is the packs, the product, everything as a whole. We pulled out of here to miss anything. And I um, always like to read your comments. Thank you for that. Appreciate your support. Uh, share this with your friends, having loved ones. eBay store link is down below in the description. That's all I got for you guys today. We might have a bonus video this weekend. Not 100% sure on that, but if we do, you'll see it up. And until then, guys, thanks again for watching. This is John Sports Card signing off. And hey, we'll see y'all soon. We actually are going to have a last second add-on. As I was throwing away the trash, I realized that the inside of, uh, of this, there was, there was an auto in here. Um, I completely zoned out about that. I saw it. I'm glad I looked because I was going to throw it away. It is uh, Gowdy Graf's Connor Gillespie. So I don't remember old Connor, and this car is probably out for a while ago. Um, there you go, 2009. So, yeah, I don't remember seeing Connor on the Giants. Uh, maybe he did make it up and just didn't have much of an impact. But, hey, it's a last year bonus. That's all, guys. See you guys over the weekend, hopefully. If not, we'll see you guys next week here at John Sports Coach. Thanks again for watching, everybody. <laughs>